Okay, in this video I'm going to show you how to recover deleted files on the Windows 7 operating system. And it doesn't matter if they were deleted from your recycle bin, it doesn't matter if they were deleted because you reformatted your hard drive, um, it really doesn't even matter if it's a USB drive um, that the files were on. I'm going to show you how you can recover those files. Now before I do, just know that if these files have been lost or deleted for a long time on your computer, there's a chance they may have been written over and you may not be able to recover them. And that's why the software that I'm going to show you here will actually scan your computer or your external device for free to show you whether those files can be recovered before you buy the software. And that's one reason why I bought it for was because I wanted to know uh, that I could actually find the files that uh, I wanted to recover before I did. And this is uh, the software is by a company called Preto Logic, and you can find it here at savemyfiles.net.net, and you can download it for free and get a scan of your computer. You can see here that they're a partner of Microsoft, so uh, this company is uh, they are very well recognized among the software industry. And you can go here and download a free copy for yourself, and you can do it right now. Actually, if you want to follow me along. Uh, so you can find out exactly how to recover or at least see the files that you can recover on your Windows 7 operating system. So I just want to go over briefly how this works and as you'll see when you install the software this is what it looks like <clears throat> and they'll give you three options here a quick scan uh, basically what this does is it quickly scans your computer and devices for files that are easily recovered now if you need to do a more in-depth scan of your computer and search deeper in the files to find something maybe this isn't uh, able to locate it you can go to full scan and it will look for those and you can also type in if you know the name of the file that you're looking for you can type the file name in here and it'll search just for those specific files and then there's also guided scan and uh, this is um, pretty neat because if you click start scan it goes through and it actually uh, guide you through the process and like the next it's going to ask you if you want to recover items from a reformatted drive if you want to recover items from an existing partition and then you choose which one uh, and, and once again you can search for a specific file name you can also recover just lost emails maybe there's uh, maybe you are storing all your emails on your computer through um, an email software and you can recover those or you can recover items on an external device such as an iPod, digital cameras, flash drives, anything that stores that you can hook up to your computer. This software will actually go out and um, <clears throat> find all those files that you think may be lost and restore them. And with the software, you can choose where you want to recover them. You just uh, name a folder on your on your on your desktop, and when it restores them, it puts them all back in that folder, so you know exactly where they're at. So, uh, but what I want to look at specifically here is how to recover the deleted files on Windows 7. Um, obviously, um, if you want to recover from a formatted hard drive, th this will be part of that process. Uh, same with emails, but if you want to recover items on an external device, um, the only difference is you're just going to choose this option and then choose your drive uh, that you want to recover the files from. So, if we want to cancel this, and we're going to go back and I want to show you the advanced tab because this is normally what I use or what I did use when I formatted my hard drive and I wanted to restore all my files because it gives you more options and here you can see uh, once again they have the field here where if you want to search for a specific file name you can enter it and then you can select if you want to scan the recycle bin maybe you accidentally deleted files out of your recycle bin and you want to make sure that uh, they're not in there it'll, it'll pull the files from there Maybe they're files you didn't name. Um, they could have came from a corrupt hard drive sector or even a reformatted partition, which was what happened in my case. And then you choose the volume drive. You probably won't have as many as I have here. I have a lot of USB drives, external drives, and whatnot hooked up to my computer. And um, you just choose the ones that you want to scan. You click Start Scan. It's going to go through the process of scanning those. And what's really neat, let me just uncheck these and I'll show you. So we'll go ahead and click Start Scan. And as it's scanning all the files, it's going to show everything down here and how many items that it found. And these are items that are not viewable that you can't see currently on your computer, and it's going to show you everything. And if you click these plus signs, it's going to expand these so you can see the names of everything. 
and then you'll actually be able to view them before you recover them which is what's really great about this because you don't have to buy the software until you know that you can recover the files that you lost or that you want and so I want to go ahead and cancel this because that may take five or ten minutes to run through um, but you can see here it, it searches for images text HTML files folders binary files other files uh, it doesn't matter if they're video if it's audio um, it'll pull any kind of file that it finds on your computer and then down here you can choose where you want to save those files and then by clicking recover it'll recover all those files and put them in that folder and really that's all there is to it so um, <clears throat> if you've in any way lost files off of Windows 7 and you're looking to recover those deleted files this software will do it um, it's 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 very accurate I've used it several times not just on Windows 7 but also on external drives and flash drives and it works very well but just remember that if the files have been lost for a long time and if you've installed or installed a lot of products on your computer or software then there's a good chance those files may have been overwritten and you may not be able to get those files back so that's why it's a good idea to make sure you come here and download the free trial first not really a free trial it's a it's like a free scan just so it can tell you what files that it can recover and then once you find out if it can recover those files you can uh, purchase it from there so I just wanted to show you guys how you can recover deleted files on Windows 7 and I certainly hope you're able to do so